So yes, my name is Trevor Parsons, and I am the chief scientist and chief ghostbuster, if you will, and co-founder at Log Entries. And a little bit like the real Ghostbusters, um, I probably spent a little bit too much time in college where uh, I did a PhD in distributed systems, built a number of APM style solutions. And similar to the Ghostbusters, I also went then and founded a company. Mine was a little bit different. Mine was looking at using log data to monitor cloud-based systems. And one of the reasons that we looked at doing this was that we saw that systems were fundamentally changing, where they were shifting, they were moving into the cloud, or they were being built completely on the cloud. And that meant that they had different properties. So for example, you couldn't necessarily see these systems. You couldn't necessarily touch or feel them. And if there was an issue on one of these systems, you couldn't necessarily walk over and look in the trunk or look in, 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 in the, under the hood of the car or, or of the system um, to understand what was going on. So you didn't have the same level of control or access. On top of that, these systems were often ephemeral in their nature, so they could scale up and scale down, and the servers could easily disappear. So not unlike a Snapchat message, for example, you send a message, it disappears, okay? You run a job on a server, and that server can disappear. And when you think about it, these systems were not unlike ghosts, or not unlike this guy who's going to appear right now, who some of you may recognize, Slimer. Um, you know, you couldn't necessarily touch these systems, you couldn't necessarily uh, uh, feel these systems. They would disappear from time to time. Um, and, uh, you know, they, they weren't unlike ghosts, but you knew that these systems existed. And when there was a performance issue in these systems, they could be particularly nasty. And you might say, well, well why was that the case? So for one, it could be difficult to instrument cloud-based systems. And when you think about it, with infrastructure as a service, for example, you only have access from the operating system level and up. With platform as a service, you only have access from the application code and up. And with software as a service ser services, um, you don't have any access when it comes to instrumentation. On top of that, because these systems would auto-scale, very often the server that your code was running on didn't even exist when you went to investigate the issue. So very often you were missing key pieces of information if you were trying to get an end-to-end -end view of these cloud-based systems. And that could make it very, very difficult for when you're trying to debug an issue or trying to resolve a performance problem. The good news is, is that all of these cloud services produce log data or they produce or have APIs that can be polled to produce a stream of information that can be fed into a, a log management system. And that information will often contain performance information. It will contain debugging or exceptions, uh, debugging information. It will also contain how a system is being used. And you can take this information, you can feed it into a log management solution, and it be can become a very powerful tool for controlling, managing, and understanding the performance of a cloud-based system. On top of that, log data also maintains the evidence. So if, for example, you are trying to investigate an issue on a, an ephemeral server that's disappeared, once you have the log data, you always have a historical view as to what was happening in that system at some point in time. So because log data is produced from every layer of the software stack and from your front-end components all the way to your back-end components, you really get a full end-to-end -end view of the system. And they really do give you the complete picture. Now, I know what you're thinking. There's probably a couple of skeptics out there. And you're probably saying, log data, really? Isn't that just some sort of cryptic data source that developers look at when there's a serious issue? And I guess I'm not here to tell you that log data is some sort of silver bullet or is a panacea. But what I am here to tell you is that log data is a very powerful tool for managing, analyzing, and understanding the performance of your cloud-based systems today. And that's largely because with Today's log management solutions, you can pick out very important pieces of information in real time, roll them up into a metrics dashboard, and be able to drill back down into the evidence. So if you do come across a gremlin like this in your system, and you don't look good, who are you going to call? Log entries, of course. Thanks. <laughs>